Welcome back everybody, we're here with our car, with our gas in the car. And I think we only need one gas can-ish thing, so uh, I'm not gonna even deal with getting another one because last time it made the zombies pretty darn angry, so right now we're gonna go to the lighthouse. Um, because then we have to bring the gas pan back to Mike, but I'm sure when we get the lighthouse, we're gonna have to bring that back to Dominic as well. So we might as well, um, go and get this taken care of. Kill two birds with one stone, kill two zombies with one hatchet. That fits this uh, this game more. We'll be on the lookout for our favorite billboard, and uh, yeah, let's go to the let's go to the lighthouse. Driving our car, they're very limited perspective of view here. Ouch! Night, night, zombie. All right, so I think we have to go up the hill of the lighthouse. That's why the flag is way over in a different direction. But I think we gotta get up here. I I think I like it's got it's got some flaws that island, but I think the game's fantastic. Nice. Here. Oh jeez! Oh, yeah, gross, 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 gross. Bust out that. That would hurt my arm. If I did that, that would hurt my arm. Carmageddon, here we go. Whoa. Evan. Okay, I'm, I'm coming, man. I'm coming. What I was going to say is I think Dead Island is a fantastic game, and you have to check it out. I think it's a must-play. I do. I do. I really do. Hey. I'm, I'm coming in. I'm coming in. Oh, okay. Or I'm not coming in. Oh, okay. Okay, well, I'm going to get out now because you're humans, and I'll talk. Oh. What's up, bro? Knocking on heaven's door. Oh, please, I hope I'm not dying. I hope these guys aren't gonna, like, eat me alive. There needs to be some cannibals in this game. Where are the cannibals who are gonna go crazy go from inside. the... Go inside! Talk to James! Okay, the cannibals going crazy from the escape. Benoit Holiday Resort trying to copy some Hollywood action there, although it's a little bit smaller. This looks like a giant, like, uh, bongo drum. I kinda wanna <laughs> hit it with my rusty pipe. Alright, um, let's go inside. The lighthouse, we're here. Hello? You I know can't me? I believe you're alive. When we left Cinemoy, you Where looked the like... Hell did I put that? Jesus. Anyway, you better go see the James. I'm sure he'll be surprised as hell to see you're still alive and kicking. Follow All right, partner, me, what's this guy saying? Whoa, whoa, hang on. I gotta talk to the, the Javier. Oh, he's just a traitor. Okay. Follow Colin. Let's go, let's go, Colin Cugler. Colin Cugler, Cugler. Javier, what are you talking about? You're a traitor. I don't know what you're... You got a lot of stuff. I don't know what you're... Whoa! Danger! No smoking, Ned! Come on now. Gosh. Oh, what are those people doing? Is that one person? Two people? Oh, I thought that was two people. But it's one lady with her arms in a very weird spot. All right. Uh, I have a full level, so I don't really need... What have we got here? What have we got here? $14. Sometimes I think my girl is like a... I don't know what. Like a British detective. James um, is at the top okay. of the lighthouse. Go okay. Bye bye. We'll go see him. Talk to James. Darvin Bar. Oh, heavy pipe. Okay. Darvin, Talk what's up, James man? First. He's the one in charge. Oh, okay. I'm not letting you into the warehouse. Talk. Oh, okay. Sorry. Goodness gracious. Okay. So I'm guessing James is up this way. Doo doo doo. Shit. You're alive. Yeah, James. What's up, man? We saw you get bit by one of those things, man. I'm James. Hmm. You don't know me, but I sure remember you. Me and Cinemoy had a slight difference of opinion. He wanted to stay put and wait for help. I wanted to get the hell out of there. So I got the hell out. Now, we're working on setting up the lighthouse to signal for assistance. We sure could use your help. All right, bud. Help the people around the lighthouse. Okay, that's not really much of a specific quest, okay. but sure. Now, if you want to get off this island with the rest of us, Go talk to my people. See what you can do to help, okay? Alright, sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good, 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 good. Alright, a recording. What's up? Tape I'm number two. What? the location where I'm to meet my informant. I must say, everything seems oddly quiet and deserted here. We could really I'm a little concerned help. that my informant has been exposed. <sighs> I hope he's all right. The door appears to be ajar. Mr. Anomo? Hello? Anyone here? We need to talk. Got the recording guy. Jesus. Have you talked to my people? Oh my Look, come God. by when you got some. Everybody's time. talking to me at once. You're There's you're overloading my brain. Everywhere. Don't see a body, though. Mr. Anomo? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> oh my God! 
whoever that was. I think I just killed her. Bashed her head in with a fucking lamp. She was out of her mind. She tried to bite me for Christ's sake. She must have been 70 years old. <laughs> All right, that was a really long recording, but he was kind of crazy. I don't know. If you guys want to hear those when I find them from now on, let me know. Otherwise, we'll try to find a way to stop him. Trevor, what do you to, need, man? Unlike uh, Cinemoy and his crew, we're not content to sit in our butts and hope that uh, help's on its way. We're more proactive, you know? Farther up the coast, there's a couple shipwrecks. The result of that monsoon that came through. I'm thinking they might have supplies, including signal flares. When help finally does get here, like maybe the military... We need a way to let them know where we are. You interested in a little salvage work? Yeah, maybe, sure, we'll see. I like how all these things are handwritten by the same guy. Like, everybody's got the same handwriting on Benoit Island. Light my fire, baby. Get four flares in the wrecks on the coast. I'll do what I can. It. Good. And when the help finally does get here, and we get their attention, I guarantee a first spot on the chopper. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We've got a, a seatmate for our helicopter ride. Sounds a little bit shady, but hey, okay, I want to make sure we complete the, um, the lighthouse quest before we activate any these other ones. What is it? This one? No. Okay, it's this one. Find a way against the lighthouse warehouse. Alright, so these guys all have quests, which we can all pick up, um, and I will, but first I want to just talk to the guy to get in the warehouse. Um, so we can kind of complete these in a very, uh, whoops, wrong way. Complete them in a very orderly fashion. Because order is best when you have the chaos of zombies. Darvin Bark. We followed James to this lighthouse so we could send out an SOS signal using the lamp. But there's something wrong with the power. Marcus went to check the two Transformers power in the lighthouse, but he's been gone for hours. Someone needs to see what's happened to him and try to get the power back on. Those things can't do to you what they can do to us. Maybe you can help us. Okay. Find Marcus and fix the Transformers power in the lighthouse. All right. All right. Good. The Transformers are in the northern part of the Gold Bungalow area. If you can get the power back on, I'll let you into the storage shed. I'm Darwin, by the way. Alright, so of course, like a good mission would, everything's building on everything. We have to help you to help him. We'll do this, we'll do that. la di da di da 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 la 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 It's like parenting. One thing is not enough. The kid wants ice cream, but that's not enough. Then he wants you to play football with him, but that's not enough. Then he wants the new SpongeBob shirt, but that's not enough. You see where I'm going with this? And actually, I uh, I, I kind of know firsthand. I have I have a, a nine ten year old brother, and I just turned ten. And uh, you know, from his from the time he was a baby, I've taken care of him for parts of the day. You know, for weeks at times, my parents go out of town, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And, uh, so I know what it's all about, and trust me, I'm giving you a very sarcastic approach to parenting. I love him to death, and I, I, it's super fun to be able to take care of a little guy like that. Um, you know, not all the time, not have to be, like, fully responsible, but, um, it's a blessing to have someone like that. Okay. Allows opening of locks, reduce repair costs, decrease stamina, increases damage, kills gain stamina, kills with modified weapons gain additional range, Okay, so it's it's down. It's either hard knocks or randori, um, or I guess pick lock. I feel like I'm doing fine fighting guys wise, so maybe we should go with pick lock. I'm gonna save it, and here's what I'm gonna do: if I fight, find a lock, then I'll use that. If I don't, then I'll use one of these, like in the near future here. Okay, so let's make sure the current quest is uh, this one. A ray of hope, yes. Okay. Where are the transformers now? Give me my map. Okay, so I gotta get. Way down to the roly poly sky here. That's Luca Craig. What's this? Find Marcus and fix the Transformers. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get back in my car then. And I'm gonna enter from the wrong side. If you see that ma magic magician magician work there. Goodbye, guys. Whoop! Alright. Okay. Let's try to turn this disastrous vehicle around here. Alright. And now, now we're riding in high, high style here. We can crush zombies with our tires, and we're about to turn on the lighthouse. We're about to do lots of glorious things here, and move the story along. I like it. I like this game a lot so far. There's there's huge areas. I've heard that there's like a city you go to in a jungle, so it's I'm super excited to see where we go from here. It's gonna be 
It should be, it will be awesome. I can guarantee that to you. Uh-oh. No, dude, don't run head first for the car. Oh my. We're, we've got a hood, hood ornament here. Boom. What if the zombie just came through the window? Wouldn't that be incredibly dangerous road trip? A thousand out of ten thousand. Hey, you've got a cleaver. I should probably pick that up. Uh, we've got guys running. So I'm just gonna drive. I'm just gonna drive and drive and drive and drive and drive. Drive, drive, drive. Oh, whoa. Silver Bungalow District. We're back here. Let's go find Mr. Marcus. Get very close to him. I'm just gonna bring the car all the way with me. So that way I can um, get right back in it. Whoops. Okay, we gotta turn around. Turn around. Alright, we're close enough. Let's get out here. Let's go. I've got this giant pipe. I'm not afraid to use it. There's zombies everywhere. I'm gonna kind of run up the rocks. I love, I love how open this game is. Like they really do a great job with that. Uh oh. Hey, hey, leave my buddy alone. Leave my Marcus alone. Really now? Can you can you please leave my Marcus alone? Sit down, sucker. Sit down, level five zombie. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Get away. Get away. Give it away. Give it away. Give it away. Get away. Alright, I think I have my rage ability, but I kind of don't want to use it right now. Because these guys I'll be able to take out handily. Boom! That's a headshot. Boom! That's a headshot. Hey, I saved you, Marcus Davis. My name's Marcus. I was fixing this piece of shit when these things came out of nowhere. See if you can get that other Transformer back online while I finish fixing this one. Go! Okay, you fix one, I'll fix the other. These guys have anything good on them? Uh, eh, knife. I, the only thing I don't like about knives is how close you have to get to the dude, which makes me a little bit nervous. Um, let me check one thing. Wait, where is it? Hang on, this is going to take me one second here. Can I see the controls, please? Controller view. Okay, B is enter fury. I was like, what is the fury meter? I don't want to accidentally press it. That's why I wanted to check. Okay, so we got 125 meters to go to the Transformer land. Hey, want to try my new knife? Ouch. How do you like knives? Ow, that's a headshot. This game is like very much, very much full of, uh, of, of gore. Like, I, I guess I didn't, when I was, <laughs> I love that <laughs> wrong side entrance of the vehicle. I didn't expect it to be, so, I mean, I guess I should have because it's like this crazy zombie killing game, but I didn't expect it to be so incredibly, like, ridiculously Ridiculously violent. All right, can I? I might as well just get out. We'll park park right here. There's our favorite billboard, or not our favorite billboard, or some billboard. Okay. All right. There's a dude over there. Hey, hey you, hey you. How do you like knives? Whoa, whoa! I, I didn't ask you to touch my knife. I just said, how do you like them? If I wanted you to touch, them, hey, have a, have a knife to your eyeball. Can I, can I can I get this guy in the eye? Let's see. No, but I can just slice him in the head. Are you alive still? How do these zombies do it? They have, like, the immunity to, to the pain, which is crazy. <laughs> hey, little man. Hey, little man. Whoop. Ouch. Whoa. Uh, the kick is so ridiculously powerful. It's amazing. It's amazing how strong that kick, or kick, 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 kick is. Okay. Guys. Leave me alone. Kick you. Oh, well. Okay. Or not. Don't grab me, don't grab me. What'd I do to you? Hey, hello. I'm standing on top of you. I'm standing on top of you. Poking you in the eyeball. Alright, we need some energy here. Could really use some energy drinks. There's probably some. Oh, hey, hello. Look. Speak the word, and you get it. Alright, what is in here? Dude, what is inside here? Hello, excuse me. Whoop! Hey, I've gotta get in here, so I'm gonna kick you in the butt because you've been a bad zombie. Bad zombie, zombie, bad. Good night. XP, fill me up. Can I get in here? No? Great. All that worked for nothing, but it did allow me to find these energy drinks, so it was worth it. Our health is growing as we level up, which is good. And the, uh, the energy drinks don't really... They don't fill you up as much as it would be nice if they did. Okay. Alright, so here's the other one. I'm guessing this might activate a zombie horde or something scary, so we'll have to be careful down here. Hello? This thing is crazy. Ah! Glitching through the door. Ah! No, that was in the red. Come on now. Whatever. Oh, jeez! Come on. Why are we Why are we beeping? Close the door. Why are we beeping? 
Why are we making that noise? That scared the heck out of me. <laughs> oh my god, this game, it just got me on edge, so I'm like constantly like, Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Alright, there's more? What is it? What are the red things here? More, okay, there's more. another power unit. There's gotta be one more. Where is it? Um, there. Good work. Now we gotta go back to Marcus. All right, so they are sending us all. Ooh, a fact. I love I facts. Love surprises. You guys like facts? Spiteful crowbar. That thing is strong as heck. Okay, so let's drop something we don't need here. And uh, like the puny homemade knife. Eh, that's actually okay. Weapon. What about these cleavers? Yeah, the feeble homemade cleaver. Um. Actually, the frightening homemade cleaver stinks. So drop that, and then we'll pick up. Spiteful crowbar. I'm spiteful with my crowbar. Um, throw the knife on the ground. That knife's about to die. Um, oh, we've unlocked another inventory slot because we have leveled up. So we've got lots of pipes everywhere. And that's cool. Alright, we gotta get back to Marcus, but I'm gonna take a little nap in here while we have some safety. Thank you guys very much for watching. A fantastic day. Hope you're enjoying these episodes. Keep liking the heck out of them, and I'll keep bringing you more of this awesome, incredible, glorious game. Don't forget to check out my other games as well. Driver. Space Marine, Resistance 3, they're all super good. So, have a fantastic day. Until next time, guys, we will see you all later.